some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Lee County, Florida, where Joey's surreal camera decides to stick his nose where it doesn't belong, mainly the Lee County uh, School Board Transportation Department where all the buses are located for the local school system. But of course, he sees a couple signs and he chooses to ignore the fact that they are there and, uh, well, ends up getting booted off the property. Poor little Joey, such an incompetent moron that he doesn't seem to realize that, uh, well, school board property is often secure areas that won't allow morons like him in. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's going on, folks? Back at it a beautiful Lee County, Florida, Fort Myers. We're out at the compound of the public school yellow buses. There's no signs saying I cannot come in here. The gate is totally open. Oh yeah, no signs out there. Uh, yeah, I'm sure you chose to ignore this one that the officers showed you later on on the only road to into this place. And the fact that this place was fenced off and gated off was no clue to you either, dude. I mean, come on now, to a regular person, that might be a red flag. But nope, to Joey Surreal Camera, that's an invitation. And, uh, well, an invitation he got to be trespassed and removed from the property. What's going on, everybody? Today I'm at the public school district at the Lee County bus campus. So I decided to drive up in here, and the reason why I drove up in here is because there's absolutely no trespassing signs, no restricted signs. The gate up front there is absolutely open. So if there's no restricted signs or trespassing signs, and the gate's completely open, I'm going through. And that's how I roll. And you're going to see now there as well, visitors parking only. As you guys can see it right there, and you can read it. So, in my book, it's open to the public. Are you stupid or something? Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, that, in anybody's book, that's not exactly open to the public. I mean, gates, fences, and the fact that you uh, ignore the signs earlier. And there's going to be another sign that uh, you'll see here in a few moments that says the exact same thing. And just because there's a visitor's parking lot doesn't make it open to the public and I'll explain to you why because well if they need people to uh, come in for job interviews they need that parking for those people who have applied for bus driving positions mechanics or any other position that's open in the transportation department I mean come on now Joey this isn't exactly rocket science here and I mean I know you're not the sharpest knife in the drawer, but you still got to figure these things out. And apparently you don't have the mental capability to do so. The cops get called. They end up showing up, folks. Don't go nowhere. It gets pretty interesting on this one. We'll see you in the comments and enjoy the video. It's a pretty big, pretty big compound, guys. Um... What was that? Can I help you? If you can help me? Yeah. Uh, not at the moment. Yeah, yeah. I'm just I'm working a little story here on these public school board buses. I'm sorry? I'm working a little story here. You have to be off campus. What can you mean? You? Why is that? Isn't this open to the public? No, sir. No? Why does it say visitors parking? I'm going to ask you to leave the premises. Who are you? I'm the director of the zone. Okay, so is this, Second is, time, is I'm this, is this a restricted area? I'm asking you to leave the premises. Why is that? Why are you telling me to leave? You're not going to talk to me? You're asking me to leave the premises, but you're not telling me anything. All right, let's go and see what this guy wants. Can we talk? Can you, just, can you not be rude? Can you, can you not be rude? Hold on. I'm trying to help you, sir. All right, look, I, I see that. But listen, 
Why is that open completely and, and it's not, not over there? I'm asking you to leave the premises. Can you read this? Is this open to the public? Is this open to the public? I don't know what's what's the issue. I come to take some video in a public in a public space, which is all this right here. I'm asking you to leave the premises. Sir. You're not answering my question, sir. This should be in the front. I didn't know that. But I'm trying to help you. Showing you should be off. Okay, so where's the administrative office at? On the other side. Okay, I will go over there and just take what, care of some business. You have to take that off, sir. What, why do I have to take this off? I don't understand that. You so know, you're, you're not willing to comply. No, but you're not. You're not complying with the First Amendment. Is my right to record in public, and this is a okay. public school board, school bus campus. Am I correct? But they still have the right to govern their property, and especially since this is a bus garage, there is a possibility that there may be children about, which is highly likely given the circumstances. So therefore, they don't want any creepy people coming in here. And, uh, well, you know what happens when creeps and children get together. Nothing good, that's what I can say. And Joey, your criminal history may not involve children, but it certainly isn't the most glamorous thing on record right now. But, but still, you would be definitely a security risk. So who are you? What's your name? What's your name? I, I'll What's give you name? my name if you give me yours. Be professional. You didn't give me your name, sir. Did you, you didn't give me yours. My name uh, is Mr. Manning. That Joey, is that's it. Right. I come with no ill will. Look, I just want to take some video. That. But you're telling me to leave a property that, that yeah. that's public. This is my concern. You're walking around. I just got here. I see you recording. And, and what's the problem with recording? It is because... It, Why is that? Because I don't know who you are. And I have I'm the public. I'm the people. I'm the public. So just because you are the public, you can come and record do whatever you want? Absolutely. As a public area, or public officials, and a, and a right. property that we pay? Yes, we can, dude. I come as a journalist recording peacefully. Okay. Anywhere this open. Show me your credentials. My credentials? Can you please tell me where to get those at? The you just told me the, you're a journalist. Uh, yeah, but listen. Tell me where to I'm get I'm trying to entertain you. Hold on. No, 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 no. No, you said you're let's, a journalist. Let's, let's talk. Let's talk. So I'm you know what my, my credential. Okay, okay, let's start from scratch. This All is right. Mr. Manny, the doctor of the zone. Okay. Show me your credential. Okay. The, uh, uh, the First uh, uh, Amendment of the Show Constitution. Show me your credential. The First Amendment of the I'm Constitution. You one my birth certificate. The, the First Amendment of the Constitution is not a credential and it does not give press any extra rights any more so than the average citizen. I mean, come on now, dude. You've been through this countless times before and you still haven't learned? Of course not. Like I said, he lacks the mental capacity for uh, reasoning. I mean, he can't, he doesn't reason like a, a normal person. In fact, his reasoning skills are, well, below uh, pre-K level at this point from what I can see. Just enough to get him by, but not enough for him to be a productive member of society. But why are you telling me I'm to leave? What, what happens if I don't leave? You understand, I'm trying to entertain you. No, I don't want you, I don't want to get entertained. You said no. you are a journalist. Yeah, exactly. And I'm asking you for your credential. Where do I get to? Who do you that? represent? Myself. Now, <laughs> Have a good day, you think the you think I exercising my rights is funny? No, no, no. I just <laughs> seriously. Have a good day. You don't want to keep talking? No. All right, get back to work. <laughs> yeah, Joey, go ahead and tell him to get back to work because you know this guy actually has a job, whereas you are a pain in the ass moron who, well, doesn't have a job and uh, well doesn't respect those who do have jobs. So let's just go ahead and skip to the part where the cops show up and uh, pretty much get this moron off the property. Five minutes later. How you doing, sir? Just recording, man. They called you. Why are you here? Huh? I'm just working on a story on these buses here. In this public property, that's all I'm doing. And a real journalist would have gone straight to the school board media department and uh, asked them permission to do so, and they would have made arrangements so you could uh, do your little story and move on. But that's not the way you are. You are here to cause an issue and upload it to YouTube, and that's all your purpose is. So you're not a uh, journalist channel because a journalist channel would have actually done that. And uh, you're not exactly a prank channel because there's actually a point to prank channels. Uh, so you're currently at this point, uh, well, a nothing channel. You're just doing this for your own purposes. That's what it looks like to me. And we're going to see what's going on. How you doing, man? 
the jaw I was expecting. What? Hey, you're not the jaw I was expecting. What do you mean? Yeah, it's Joel, right? Yeah. Not the one I was expecting. Yeah. Did you speed out in Benita? I, nah, I already I got out of there, bro. That's so you were on Benita before the bar? I was, yeah, I was. A couple years ago. What was your old YouTube account called? What was that? What was your old YouTube account called? My old well, Joey Surreal Camera. Huh? Joey Surreal Camera. But it's not that no more, it's surreal cam. Gotcha. Yeah, so I'm over here. I never been here. And I came in here, the gates open. I did my research, it's public property. And I was just recording. It's actually not public property, it's private property. Well, how's it private? If it's not open, look, it, oh, there's no signs there's a there. sign right out front by the gate. It says private property. If you want, I can show you the sign. You want to show me the sign? Absolutely. Okay, yeah. I didn't see it. I can't. It says visitors parking here. And I wanted to conduct some business. Yeah, this is, this is the but why is it? Well, that's fine. If there's a sign, I, I, I made sure before I came in here, maybe I missed it. Now, of course, they walk up to the uh, intersection where the uh, sign is at, and you can see it just enough from the back end to know it's there, and it's pretty legible from the front end. So, Joey, uh, what is your pathetic little excuse for not seeing this uh, sign? Oh, wait, spoiler alert, he thinks it's an old crusty sign that he didn't need to pay attention to, so he moved on. Uh, Joey, maybe you should start uh, looking at things that may not uh, be appealing to you because they may be the most beneficial to you. Just a hint for your pathetic little life. Law by law, you know what I mean? See what I'm saying? There goes that stupid, dirty sign again. The same one that we just saw a few minutes ago inside. I mean, I still don't see no trespassing signs. A, this is a restricted area beyond this point sign. Nowhere near the gate at all. What, the big red letters that say private property is not an indicator that it might be private property and restricted to uh, the general public? Are you that freaking stupid that this may be an indicator that this is a place where you're going to get trespassed? Are you that freaking stupid, Joey? Well, of course you are. You're Joey Surreal Camera, the dullest knife in the drawer. There's no statue code either, but that's, I might have missed the sign, but that's open too, so yeah, this isn't the first time that I, that I do stories on yellow, public school board yellow buses, you know what I mean? Yeah. And that should be a, there should be a Florida school statue code on that I think too. is public property, but obviously the bus barn is not Okay, so I didn't see that. I did look, but I didn't see it. But that's the first time this happens because I've been to other public school board uh, compounds and it's open the, the, to the, the public school board building itself i'm pretty sure it's public property but yeah. obviously the bus pack the and bus that's is for, not public property it's considered its own enemy yeah but that, who pays it for that property taxpayers they don't pay for it so it's public school board public school buses you know what i mean that's all i was doing bro i was just recording the recording the inside of all the you know where they where they work do the mechanic work that's it i didn't go into restricted areas i don't do that you know what i'm doing oh you didn't go into any restricted areas dude that whole area is a restricted area i mean come on now dude think joey think this is not rocket science Joey, I'm beginning to question something. How can you be this stupid and still be uh, breathing at this point in your life? I mean, there had to be a point in your life where you uh, stopped breathing and then somebody ended up tell, telling you, Joey, you got to start breathing. You got to do that in order to uh, live. You strike me as that kind of person that was like that at one point in your life. But anyway, he is booted off the property for... Well, being a complete ignoramus who can't seem to understand how signs work or anything like that, restricted areas, or, yeah, it, it, he's just not that bright of a dude. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro?
Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?